Hi, uh, in this video we'll see how to control a stepper motor from LabVIEW uh, with the help of Arduino. Uh, uh, this particular video is for controlling a unipolar stepper motor. Uh, the unipolar stepper motor has uh, 6 or 5 wires. It depends upon uh, the motor uh, manufacturer. So the particular one I'm having is a 6 uh, uh, wire stepper motor. The stem center tapping wire here, so you can see here the three windings on the upper side and three on the lower side. The center tapping wire for this particular motor is for the power supply. The other uh, four for controlling the motor, which will send a, a synchronous signals to the stepper motor. So here you can see it has uh, six wires. So the first two wires has to be connected to the power supply and the four for the uh, input pins of the Arduino and here you can see uh, I've used the uh, STA401 drive uh, which uh, can be used for a stepper motor or you can use a ULN2003 um, uh, also for controlling this uh, uni uh, unipolar stepper motor so this is a circuit diagram so uh, sorry circuit connection I uh, connected the four uh, pins uh, of the stepper motor to the Arduino 8, 9, 10 and 11 pins. So the stepper motor is uh, powered separately. So I am not using a power from the Arduino. I am uh, powering the uh, stepper motor separately from the Arduino. So this is a stepper motor. Once again I am showing for you. Uh, this stepper motor I took from a uh, old floppy disk. So I'm uh, connecting uh, Arduino to my laptop. So I'm powering the Arduino now. And I'm connecting a uh, power supply to the stepper motor. So here you can see this is the front panel for the stepper motor control. <coughs> so here is the block diagram that I've created to control the stepper motor in clockwise and anti-clockwise direction. Uh, this block is for controlling the motor in the clockwise direction. So if you go on and click the radio selection button too and you can see that uh, you have a control for the motor in anti-clockwise direction. So you can also control the speed of the motor by uh, giving a delay so this one is uh, a delay between uh, uh, one step to another step check the com port and it is in 27 so here um, running the lab view program so it's running and Arduino is acknowledging that I have successfully connected to the lab uh, lab view and I am going to reduce the speed initially and it is in anti-clockwise so this I have not the motor I have not fixed it so I have to be careful uh, with the motor so it can uh, slip from the breadboard so I am going to start this one so initially the speed was high so that's the reason the motor is uh, rotating faster so if I reduce the speed of uh, so here you can see that the speed is gradually decreasing here uh, due to the cam uh, that is capturing the speed uh, the motion is not varying uh, exactly so it's just capturing the image so that's the reason but the motor now is running really slower so you can see so in compared to the initial speed and now it's really running in a stepwise manner so you can see here it is really slow so if I increase the speed you can see here it is running really faster here so this is uh, uh, actually a delay between uh, one step to another so I'm controlling the speed of the motor with the delay 
so if I go for a clockwise so here you can see that the direction is changing for the step promoter so if I reduce it it's going really fast it's actually delay it's not speed so I'm giving the more delay of the motor it's really moving slower so if I turn to the anti-clockwise let's change the direction to anti-clockwise you can download this uh, PI I will later upload to my blog and thank for watching if you like this video please subscribe to my channel and share this video with your friends thanks for watching once again